and they were a bit more subtle. They just looked like regular normal bars. Now, this couple came in, they'd been there for an hour, and I think he'd noticed there was a lot of things his brain couldn't compute happening around him, like a lot of beard on beard action going on, okay? That was just some of the lesbians, right? And, he's, I mean, <laughs> and so he's, he's feeling, probably felt a little bit, well, this is a bit unusual. So he went up to the bar where I was, and he said, Excuse me, is this a gay bar? I said, well, it's not a gay bar as such, it's a gay friendly, it's the PC term. You know, anyone can come here and drink, just like any other bar. But we do have a lot of gay clientele, they come and go as they please. Then he asked me the weirdest question. He said, I'm here with my wife, will we feel uncomfortable at any time? <laughs> <laughs> well, not if you use some lubricant, sir, I've got some back here. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think was going to happen? It's eight o'clock, it's fisting time! Come on, <laughs> everyone grab it up, oh, you've got to What do you think was going to happen? And it's weird the nature of homophobia, because there's one theory about homophobia, that if you're homophobic, if you're a bloke and you're homophobic, it's because you've got suppressed homosexual urges. I'm sure we might have heard this theory. If you're homophobic, it's because you've got gay desires in your body and they're shameful to you. So they manifest in a hatred of gay people. There's lots of evidence to prove that this might be the case. There's even evidence to suggest that Hitler was a homosexual. Which, you know, might sound a bit shocking, but when you think about it, you know, all the leather boots and all this fucking business. <laughs> See, Kyle? Yes, sure, love, yeah. Swastika looks like an anus. Anyone else? That, no, forget it. <laughs> but, you know, there's, there's a recent case, this is brilliant, there's a recent case in America, a guy called Ted Haggard, who is uh, he's the leader of the American Evangelical Church, right? Big fucking church in America. He was the head of the leader of the, uh, the American Church of Evangelicals. Notoriously homophobic. Gets caught by his wife, being shagged in the arse by a 17-year-old Romanian red boy, while smoking crystal meth and wanking over gay porn. No, I have a lot of respect for this guy, because I think if you're going to do something wrong, we'll fucking do it right. <laughs> <laughs> you no, know, wanking over gay porn, not enough. Smoking crystal meth as well, possibly. 17 year old red boy fucking you in the arse. That's the fucking ticket. <laughs> and he got caught by his wife, and you just know what happened, didn't you? He's there, Eastern European lad, he's, a, he's got his crystal meth pipe, he's smoking it, he's wanking over gay porn, and you just know that his wife walked in and he went, this isn't what it looks like. <laughs> Straight through the horn, your one gives me the horn I'm gonna fuck a jewel torn, leave her up soul torn Magic like David Blaine, I'm completely insane Beat the fall, blood stained, shit and piss and drop the rain Don't fuck with me, cause you're gonna get shot When you wake up and find that I'm eating your cock bone Oh no, I'm drunk you with pneumonia Make a video, you wish I'd never fucking shown ya Yeah! That's right! I'm ripping on! Back motherfuckers! Flag me! Fucking house down! <laughs> Bye -bye. It's red.